Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about square invoices and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you download your sales report from square? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you need a sales report from square anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you run a small business, you know that sometimes you like to go over your sales reports or sometimes your accountant asks for that as well. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process process is handled here in the Square Invoices app. It's this blue and white one here on the top center. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to go ahead and open up my Square Invoices app now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened up my Square app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to get your sales report from Square, you need to click on the more button down here on the bottom right. It's three horizontal lines. Once you do that, you will see a drop down menu and you want to scroll down until you see this line right here called reports. It looks like a little line chart. Once you do that, you want to click on sales. Okay, so here is where you can go ahead and download your Square sales report. So you can choose what time frame you want. So one day, one week, one month, three months, or one year. Now, if you want a specific time frame, you can easily just click on this button here on the top in blue, and then you can go ahead and customate the date. So let's do 16th through the 23rd of May. You can also narrow it down by an exact time. So after 1 a.m. or before 12 p.m., or you can just include the 24 hour period right here. So click on done. All right, so now we have set up our sales report on Square. And now what you're going to do is click on this kind of upload button here on the top right. It looks like a little upward arrow. Okay. Once you do that, then you want to go ahead and click on email. And then that sales report would be emailed directly to you. And that usually arrives within about 10 seconds. So let me go ahead and email that. Okay. It's sending. Okay. Like I said, just about 10 seconds later, I did receive a notification that I got an email from Square. So let me jump on over to that email. Okay. So here is the email that I received from Square. So this is my sales report that I ordered and it's going to go over sales, gross sales, service charges, net sales, sales and payments and fees. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to get a sales report from Square, that is the easiest way I know how to find it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.